Hey, Klaus here, e-commerce business coach and growth advisor. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I want to talk about a website or websites that are generally bad for sellers on Shopify. Um, these types of websites basically grab codes from either your newsletters or from your stores and offer these um, codes then, discount codes then to potential buyers. So you're basically losing out on, um, on, on profit, on revenue. Um, when they show old codes, discount coupon codes that you don't use anymore. So basically what's happening is somebody comes to your store, wants to buy something, and then from time to time you see in your screen recordings that people are leaving the browsers and coming back after a while. So what they usually do is they go out and look if they can find any discount coupons out there that they then can use in the checkout of your store. Now, obviously with that, you're losing money and um, you don't want to avoid that. Well, there's a couple of strategies um, to avoid that. First of all, work as possible with dynamic coupon codes that are only working with specific customers. And then if you have static coupon codes, for instance, for email um, campaigns or any kind of promotions, make sure that they are time limited and expire after a couple of days so they don't won't work anymore. So 100% make sure in your Shopify setup that there are not any old coupon codes that are still active and um, that can be picked up by, for instance, simply codes or similar search engines for coupon codes and then um, basically make you lose money through that. Now, you see simple codes here says stop searching for coupon codes. That's actually what they do now. But you can use these sites actually for your advantage. And I will show you on how you can do this. So I just opened a store here. I don't know the store. I actually don't know what they are selling. Um, so, but obviously Simply Codes has found discount codes for the Mahabis store. And as you can see here, they found a couple of um, codes here and um, they are actually quite recent. So they verified two, three hours ago. So this store obviously has a couple of coupon codes in there, all for 10% off at the store. So somebody who would go there would find discount code and then get their purchase 10% less. Now, what we'll want to look in here is obviously you want to check if there's any store uh, codes there from your store um, that you don't want to have publicly available. And then obviously, um, once you find them here, go back to your Shopify and then um, deactivate them. Now, if we go down here, it also shows um, sort of how often um, coupon codes are coming up on this store. Now you can use that for your benefit if you do customer research. You might go and just look if your um, competitors are offering um, or are listed on simplycodes.com and you go in there and see how many discount codes they have, um, what kind of discount range percentage wise they offer and you get all of these details here and then it gives you even more information down here where basically they get the discount code from. So that gives us a couple of um, uh, information there where you want to look and something like that. And then if you go down here, they also will give you the information on how often your competitor is launching promo codes, um, when the next one will be available, um, if they're site-wide and so on and so forth, where you can find them. And all of this information can be very useful for your own store so that you can find out um, what is kind of the discount um, or promotion strategy of your competitor. So if you see something in there that they are um, either offer all the time or repeatedly offer, um, then obviously it gives you a, a very good clue that this is working for them. And then you might um, try that out for your own store. Also, you will see here what kinds of promotions they do because you can see on the promo code itself is like, um, is there anything specific on a promotion? Um, that might be a 4th of July, for instance, um, that you then also know when are they doing specific um, promotions. And then another benefit of the site here, below your competitor's store, you will find other stores that are in the same niche or industry. So you might find other competitors there that you're aware of, or you might even find websites and stores in there that are competing with 
whatever you offer and um, you do not know about them. So you don't um, want to go in there and see what they are doing, what they're offering, what are their best selling products, what's their strategy and so on and so forth. So I would highly recommend to go to Simply Codes, start searching for your own store and um, then basically clean out any kind of um, discount codes that you don't want to be listed there and um, then go deeper in and look what competitors are doing and to get some information out of this that you can then use for your own marketing and um, discount promotion strategies. I hope that makes sense. If you have questions, please leave them in a the comment. I'll read them all and I uh, wish you a great day. Chat soon. Thank you.